Hello guys, in this video I'll show you how you can take user input of strings in Python. So let's uh, take input from the user on about his favorite fruit. So let us first define the list. We don't define the uh, size of the list over here as we used to do it in C or C++. Um, so we'll simply write fruits. Uh, I don't know about Java, but in C or C++ we used to write uh, the size of the list initially. So I'll write the for loop for x in range. Let's say to write five of his favorite fruits. And now we'll take the input. So that input will be stored in an object uh, k and input of let's say enter your fruit and let us print it in different line. Then, then uh, what you have to do is you have to append it. Uh, the need of append arises here because we don't know the size of the array. And append is used to as the compiler will know that where from where he'll have to add um, add the new fruit and after we have appended it let us print the whole list to see whether this code works or not and save it let's run it over. and So let's say write apple, banana, orange, grapes, banana. So it will display all the input strings or you can say the fruits uh, that you have, the user has input. So this is how uh, I take input. Uh, there are other ways to provide the input as well. So there's split function and there are many different ways, raw input and uh, yeah, that's how it's done. Uh, if you're a C programmer, I think this will be the best uh, way. Other ways might be confusing for you. So yeah.